The sequence and arpeggiated instruments, or seek and arp, work similarly to a classic step sequencer, allowing you to define a progression of 16 values playing back at a constant rate. The tempo can be synced to either the host or master control tempo. The sequencer controls three different parameters, velocity, filter, and pan. To the left of the sequence edit window is a drop-down menu which will display one of the three parameters in that window. The filter knob controls the frequency range of the filter sequence. There are 12 user programmable chromatic key switchable presets. The preset knob, located at the top right, represents the key that you have selected. The key switching has been preset to A-1 through A-0, but can be changed to your liking by clicking the Learn KS button and then depressing the desired key on your keyboard. As a template for use, we have provided 12 factory presets and assigned them to each of the key switch preset slots. You can also select each of the presets from the Edit drop-down menu. In the Sequencer window, clicking and dragging the mouse vertically will change the value of an individual step. To redraw all of the sequence steps in a linear fashion, right-click or control-click on a Mac and drag the mouse horizontally. To randomly change each of the 16 values in the displayed parameter, click the Randomizer button. You can also click the Reset button to start from a flat pattern. To copy your newly created sequence to another slot, Open the Edit drop-down menu and click Copy Preset. Then select a different preset slot, either by hitting a key switch key or turning the preset knob. And select Paste Preset to Knob in the pull-down menu. If you are in standalone mode, you must save the instrument preset to keep the newly created sequence. If you are in plug-in mode, the preset will be saved with the session. The tempo knob controls the rate of the steps in the sequencer. The steps range from quarter notes to 1 28th notes. You also have the option of selecting an input quantization, ranging from no quantization to one full bar, or one sixteenth note. You can also control the sustain of each step in the sequence. To alter the sustain, click and drag your mouse up and down on the number in the sustain bar. Similar to the other instruments in Evolve, there is an effects menu with three knobs attached. In this menu, you can control delay, reverb, and phaser effects. For more information on using the Seek and ARP presets, be sure to check the user manual and Heaviosity forums.